10 Shocking Projects Transforming Ghana Ghana is a multi-ethnic country in West Africa with a diverse population, linguistic, and religious groups. In 2019, this country spanning the Gulf of Guinea was named the world's fastest growing economy, and it was recently ranked the eighth richest country in Africa. The government is not giving up on her efforts to make Ghana a great country. Ghana has made significant progress in recent years as a result of the government's sustainable development policy. Roads, bridges, stadiums, airports, theaters, and other infrastructure are being built across the country. Some of these projects are so advanced and intriguing that it is surprising to learn that they are located in Ghana. Hello and welcome to Africa Reloaded, where we make educational and entertaining videos about Africa. Today, we will look at the 10 shocking projects that are transforming Ghana. Stay with us as we take you on this epic journey, but don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel as we ride along in no particular order. 10. Pokiwase Interchange This is a strategic road interchange that connects Tema's port to Kumasi and then to Burkina Faso. The Pokiwase Interchange in Ghana is an important part of the Central Corridor Infrastructure Project for the West African country on the Gulf of Guinea. The $84 million transaction is the first of its kind in West Africa and the second largest in Africa. The interchange was originally three-tiered, but the Akufo Addo administration changed it to four-tiered on the advice of the constructor, making it the largest in West Africa. Construction began in 2018 and was completed on July 9, 2021 by President Nana Akufo Addo. 9. Signature Apartments This is a luxury apartment in the newly built Shaishi neighborhood of East Ligon, close to the Kwashi Interchange and opposite the Accra Mall. This massive development structure is a 35-story tower with a four-story basement car park and a state-of-the-art resident area with a pool and outdoor area, as well as one, two, and three-bedroom apartments and a four-bedroom penthouse with a private pool. The building's design provides breathtaking views of the Accra skyline. Each apartment, from a studio to a three-bedroom, has floor-to-ceiling windows that open up to the pool or the vast Tete Quarshi circle. The grounds feature landscaping designs such as palm trees, which will have you surrendering to the paradise atmosphere. They also provide a one-of-a-kind apartment living experience by bringing the outdoors inside. The newly constructed Shaishi Road and the additional streetlights make it safe for residents to explore the town on foot or by bike. 8. Kumasi International Airport The $300 million international airport in Kumasi, Ghana's capital city, is regarded as one of the most vibrant and second-largest international airports after the Kotoka International Airport. The Kumasi International Airport was built to be a domestic airport, but it has since been upgraded to an international airport. This airport now provides domestic and international aviation services to the people of Ashanti and the rest of the country. The airport's new terminal will transform it into a full-fledged international airport. The expansion project is part of the government's multi-model transportation system, being developed to promote tourism in the Ashanti region. The expansion will also help to meet rising demand by increasing capacity for international passengers. The project includes extending the runway from 1,981 meters to 2,300 meters to accommodate Boeing 737-800 series aircraft, building a new terminal, adding aprons, building a two-story ultramodern terminal, and other ancillary works. When completed, the new terminal will be able to handle 1 million passengers per year. 7. Tema Port Phase 1 Tema, about 30 kilometers from Ghana's capital city of Accra, is home to roughly 70% of Ghana's major container and port handling traffic. Meridian Port Services Limited announced in April 2020 that it had completed Phase 1 of the Tema Port expansion process, also known as Terminal 3 of Tema Port. 
The expansion included the construction of a new harbor basin along a three-kilometer-long beach directly on the Atlantic Ocean and the Meridian Timeline. It also saw the construction of 1,000-meter-long wharf with three berths and 242 acres of terminal facility on sea-reclaimed land. This included all drainage, sewage, water, fire, electrical, and information technology services as well as a 60-bay customs clearance shed, six scanners, several gate facilities, and 1,400 reefer container plugs. The new harbor's breakwater route extends 1,550 meters into the ocean, with a two kilometers long arm extending eastward from the breakwater's route parallel to the key wall. Six. Phase 1 of the Takarati Tema Interconnection, the Ghana National Petroleum Cooperation has launched Phase 1 of the Takarati Tema Interconnection projects, which will increase natural gas flow from Ghana's west to Tema. The first phase's completion has paved the way for the smooth flow of gas from the Abozal Power Enclave to the Tema Accra Power and Industrial Enclave. This was archived with the assistance and collaboration of ENI Ghana Exploration and Petroleum Limited, Vito Ghana Upstream, Ghana National Gas Company, and West Africa Gas Pipeline Company. This project is expected to double Ghana Gas's capacity to transport GMCP gas to critical national power generating facilities. This also will accommodate gas supply from Ghana's offshore Jubilee field via the new Jubilee Aduabo Gas Pipeline and Aduabo Abodes Gas Pipeline. 5. Kotoka Airport Terminal 3 Ghana Airports Company Limited, GSCL, the airport operator and manager, broke ground on its flagship project, Terminal 3, at Kotoka International Airport, KIA, in March 2016. The new terminal was finished in June 2018 and opened to traffic three months later. The new international terminal has five levels and covers an area of 45,000 square meters. This terminal has six contact stands for code six aircraft and two remote stands. The terminal can handle over 1,250 passengers at peak times, has large retail and commercial areas, three business languages, seven bridges that can be expanded to eight, and plenty of parking. The terminal's departure level has 56 checks in desks and 30 passport control counters, including four e-gate positions and eight security links. The arrival level has 47 immigration centers, four e-gate positions that can be expanded to eight, and four baggage claim areas. This airport terminal three is breathtaking in its design. Four, Kwame Nkrumah Interchange, this interchange was built to replace the Kwame Nkrumah Circle in Accra's downtown. It first opened its doors in 2016. The interchange is named after Ghana's first president, Kwame Nkrumah, who led the country's struggle for independence from Britain. The Kwame Nkrumah Circle, which handles over 84,000 vehicles from arterial roads and their intersections daily, necessitated the construction of the interchange. The current roads are no longer capable of addressing traffic congestion issues in an effective and efficient manner. 3. Accra Mall The new Accra Mall took two years to build, with hundreds of people working on the project when it was at its peak. Ghana's only world-class shopping mall, with over 70 retail stores and entertainment options. The Accra Mall is a shopping center in Accra, Ghana, on the Spintex Road, next to the Tema Motorway. On July 4, 2008, the mall was officially opened. Atterbury Property Development, Sanlem, and the Usu Akio family own it. ShopRite, Game, Mr. Price, and other South African clothing and accessory retailers are present. Boxing Day has recently become known as Accra Mall Day, as many young people flock to the mall to have a good time. One of the difficulties encountered during the mall's construction was the requirement that all engineering processes ensure that the earthquake zone requirement is incorporated into the design. The Accra Mall is West Africa's first grade a shopping center and one of the largest modern malls. 2. Kajisha Market 
The Kajisha Market, also known as the Kumesi Central Market, is an open-air market in the city of Kumesi that serves not only the Genning Kumesi region, but also acts as a market for traders from neighboring countries. The concept for this project is based on the integration of the exterior and interior, proposing a covered complex divided into two large commercial halls that are linked by a large and humanized gallery along the building's longitudinal axis. The central zone features a large square with wide ramps serving as the main visitor circulation zone and connecting the various levels. The lower floor is entirely dedicated to parking. The market has over 1,200 stores and stalls and receives approximately 500,000 visitors per day. The building has a total area of approximately 172,197 square meters. The market is intended to promote economic growth, tourism, and socioeconomic development. 1. Bellagio Vista The Bellagio Vista is a three-tower complex overlooking a central garden in Accra's affluent airport residential area. The towers are aqua, green kent design, which has 8 to 10 floors, azure, red kent design, which has 17 floors, and alto, which has 27 floors, and is Ghana's tallest residential building, Yellow Kent Design. Trasaco Estates Development Company Limited developed the Villagio Vista, which was designed by Alford Hall Monaghan Morris Architects, a British firm that also designed 240 Blackfriars Road, a large office building in London. The Villagio Vista was completed in 2016 and consists primarily of residential space of approximately 38,500 square meters. The Villagio Vista complex is a beautiful apartment complex that illuminates the Accra skyline. Its distinctive architectural design and colors immediately draw attention. A fitness center, swimming pools, tennis courts, a playground, and underground parking are all available. On the ground floor, there is also a small commercial office component, a gym, and a retail slash restaurant space. The top of the Alto also has a sky bar with a breathtaking panoramic view of Accra's beautiful city. These are just a few of the incredible projects that are transforming Ghana. Which of the projects did you enjoy the most? Make a comment on it. Please support and subscribe to Africa Reloaded. Remember to enable the notification icon to stay up to date on our latest videos.